Okay. One of the simple tools that is good to have in your glass, glass repertoire is a scoring knife. And what it does is it's it, you can cut tubing and rod to certain sizes. Now, first you press firmly and you've got to scratch it and you're going to hear a scratching noise. You then lick your finger and wet it, or if you have some water handy, wet it. The, the score, put your thumbs at 6 o'clock or 12 o'clock, and the score exa uh, exactly opposite of it, and press away. And it gives you a nice, clean snap. Gives you a chance to, you know, instead of having this long, long tube, sometimes you want to make it a little shorter. That's the way to do it. Just, again, you're listening for that scratching noise, and you'll see a nice score mark. You wet it, and 6 o'clock is your fingers, 12 o'clock, and you're pushing and pulling away at the same time. It's kind of crazy, but it does the job. Okay, another one, and I'm going to use this. I've also been playing with plastic with this. That's why it's got all that crud on there but it doesn't tend to contaminate the glass but it is good to have of all things a butter knife <laughs> simple tools that's the whole thing they're all around you and sometimes you you don't even think about it if it's made out of stainless steel like scissors or or um you know, some surgical stuff that you can pick up at a flea market or something like that. You can use it as a potential tool, simple tool, in glass blowing. Okay? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. That's my quote for from, uh, <laughs> I guess at South Park, isn't it? Okay, okay. I don't know. Let's see if we can get this going here, and it's not cooperating. Oh, you know why it's not cooperating? Okay. I can't pause it. Just give me a second. Just got in here. <laughs> no, it's all things. I forgot to turn on the propane tank. <laughs> Luckily, it's not too far away. There we go. <laughs> I'd forget my head if it wasn't tied on. And no, I didn't forget that I didn't owe you any money. <laughs> so, let's go with this. There we go. There we go. Light up my life. Now, a butter knife, you can do many things with it. That will come in handy. And you can do things to uh, change the design. Also, if you had a, a file, a diamond cut file, I think I mentioned that in the last set of simple tools, you could press the diamond cut file, or I might not have, I'm sorry. You could press the diamond cut file into a flat piece of glass, and then you've got a diamond cut pattern that you can either fume or paint with you know, gold and fire, and then you got uh, some things there, okay? I know, I'm a little scatterbrained, but aren't we all? <laughs> there we go. I'm going to flatten it a little bit better than that. Now with that, you can press in. Another thing I like to do with, especially a butter knife, simple pattern. Let me do this again. We all love simple things. This is one of the most simple things you can do. 
Okay. You got a nice disc shape. You then, of all things, just press halfway. And now you've got a heart. There you go. Simple, simple. Now you could sort of add some texture. And there you go, see? It, it's all in the simpleness of it all. I say that. And then if you fume it with silver, which is another simple tool, make sure you get good ventilation, by the way. Okay, okay. It leaves impressions. It You can then, you know, if you wanted to, I'm just playing with it, but it gives you ideas to, you know, if you wanted to make a four leaf clover, you just, instead of putting one indentation, you know, it's getting a little, it was a little hot. You intensify in one spot, press in, intensify in another spot, press in. See? Make something out of it. But you didn't know that you could do five minutes ago. And again, it's simple tools. It's simple things. You don't have to, you know, it doesn't have to be complex tools sometimes. Okay. Now. Again, I was just playing. Another simple tool. Watch this. Press there, press there, press there, press there, and now you've got a different image altogether. Just by trying, just by playing, just by... Ooh, now that looks interesting. Almost like the thing of a tree. Now let, let me do that again. Again, it's, it's using it to your advantage. Using... Simple tools. Now, a lot of tools nowadays have a spring-loaded system on their, their pliers or whatever. Me, <laughs> when I started in 1982, I had to learn to do it the hard way. Open and close it yourself. Big deal. Okay. There. Do that one. Do that one. That one, and now I'm going to get a different design going, design pattern going. Hey, that'll work. That'll be interesting. I have a pair of regular pliers that have lines in them. It's it's all in the patterns. It doesn't have to be perfect. It just has to something you can play with. Try it. Go somewhere different that you didn't think about five minutes ago. Okay. And it doesn't have to look pretty this time around, but it can. If you had an idea, going back to some other simple tools. See, it doesn't have to work hard. It doesn't have to be exact. It can, but it doesn't have to be. Just by heating, stretching, pulling, playing with the glass. And you'll come across an idea or an image that you thought, hey, I hadn't thought about that before. That's the whole idea. Just like when I was pressing that first time, I thought, hey, that looks like something. I actually thought it looked like the impression of a tree trunk in there. And I guess if I had some needle nose pliers, which I didn't have 
handy Andy, but I do have some somewhere. Um, I'd have probably made sort of like a tree trunk type thing or a tree inside or, uh, the image of a tree, sort of like a bonsai what the idea I had didn't happen, but you come across ideas, you make it work, you try to make it work, and if it doesn't, big deal. And if it does, hey, more power to you. But it gives you a way to manipulate and control glass that you didn't think about five minutes ago. That's the whole idea of simple tools. Don't you can work towards a goal, and sometimes it's good to not really have a goal in mind, but just sit down and work it. Um, and if you're stumped for ideas, you know what I usually do? Um, I'll do things like this. You know, I just scored all these pieces of tubing, and uh, it was to demonstrate the idea of a scoring knife but if you got short pieces that you want to make a little longer all it takes is putting them together and that also helps with your learning to flow the glass learning to work with the glass learning to create believe it or not as you can tell where that seal is but it's a good seal and yes you can work on to where you can't even tell that there's a there was a seal there that's a cool thing too okay okay people that's an end, to, an end of another simple tool if you have other ideas or tools that you would like me to try to demonstrate, if I have them, I would be glad to try. Uh, and also, if you had some ideas, I'm also uh, open for ideas, yes. Anyway, enjoy your day.